In this video, we will create a new Smoke library and import media inside Smoke. You can download and use the clip provided with this exercise or import your own media. The Smoke library contains tools for managing and organizing media. Each project can have one or several libraries. You can create a library on the Edit Desk or inside the Library menu. To create a new library, press the New button on the Edit Desk. Type a name for the library and press Enter. The library is added to the project. Press Open to access the Library menu. You have two types of entries in the Library Browser. Smoke libraries that only Smoke can access and manage, such as the library you just created, and the gateway entry that is used to navigate the computer drives. The default path is slash volumes on the Mac system. Now we're going to copy footage from the drives to the Smoke library. Choose the dual view mode. Select the option Copy on Drag. Click the top browser and select the new Smoke library you just created. Click the bottom browser and select slash volumes to navigate your drives. Navigate to the location of your media. Click the triangles to expand and collapse the folders. The scroll bar is on the left side. In this example, my footage is on the Mac desktop, so I must find my Mac user and open the desktop folder that contains the clips I need. Select the clips you want to use in Smoke, and then drag these clips to the Smoke library. You can also select and drag an entire folder. The footage is now available inside the Smoke library. The media was not duplicated as the load option Store Local Copy was not activated. The clips in the Smoke library are linked to the original footage. If you activate that option, the clips will be duplicated. In the next video, we'll organize the footage inside the library.